what you need before bringing a puppy home. So congratulations, um, you've made the decision to get a puppy. Uh, hopefully you listened to my or read my last blog on what to think about when choosing a puppy and you've chosen a puppy that will fit in with your lifestyle. To ensure your puppy and you have an easy transition, I'm going to give you a list of things to have and do before bringing your cute bundle of energy into your home. Hi, I'm Belinda Marinas and I'm owner and head trainer with Hill Sit and Stay Dog Obedience. I'm passionate about helping and training dogs and owners to understand and communicate with each other, uh, to build happy, fulfilling, long-term relationships. All right, so the list. Firstly, the essentials. Make sure you have the following items before you bring your puppy home. Once your puppy's home, you don't wanna be running to the shops every few hours for the things that you need. Okay, firstly, puppy collar for an ID tag and to help with some training. A puppy lead for safety and also to control and help with some training. A food bowl for meals and of course puppy food. A water bowl, some bedding, a crate or kennel, toileting pads for toilet training, chew toys. Baby gates are a wonderful extra you can have to restrict access to various rooms safely. And last but not least, a puppy pen or fully fenced secure yard. It might sound obvious, but spend the time checking your fencing. You don't want your puppy to get out of your yard. Also check what's in your garden. Make sure there isn't anything puppy might eat or get into that's dangerous. They'll want to discover the world, so let's make it as safe as possible. Also, if your puppy is gonna be allowed inside the house, ensure it's safe. Don't leave toys, shoes, things like that that your puppy may get into. Chemicals and cleaning products may need to be moved. Uh, puppy proof the house before they come home. Make sure everyone in the household agrees on the puppy rules. Dogs like to know boundaries and there's nothing more confusing than different people teaching your puppy different things. What rooms they're allowed in, where they're going to sleep. Make sure these decisions are made before your cute bundle of fluff comes home and changes your mind. If you have questions about products or other items for your puppy, uh, please email or comment below um, and don't forget to subscribe for more tips and information for you and your puppy. After you pick up your puppy, watch my next blog on Puppy's Home. Now what?